Okay, so I just received an interesting piece of inside information and this comes directly through a friend of a friend who works inside a distribution center here in the Seattle Puget Sound region. It's one of the top logistics companies internationally. You would know their name if I were to tell you. They're currently doing seasonal work in there, basically doing box packaging, unpackaging, container unloading and reshipping of product in and out of this warehouse. Now, what is the interesting piece of information? They are getting sent home early every single day. The reason they're being sent home early every day, it has to do with the container volumes and the amount of incoming shipments into the warehouse being lower than anticipated. In other words, there's no work for them to do. Now, why are these container volumes lower and, and what's the primary driver of this? It continues to be this issue and battle that we're seeing going on in the Red Sea region. This carrier, for example, is rerouting a lot of their shipments, their container ships, around the Cape of Good Hope in order to avoid going through the Red Sea. They continue to run into problems in the Red Sea, and by shipping around the Cape of Good Hope, it's taking them longer, it's costing them more, they're on average using about 40% more fuel, and what's really happening then, that additional charge is getting passed back to their customers, which then gets passed back to us as the consumer, as the end user of these goods. So it's a great example of what's happening right now going on in our supply chain. It's a problem, it needs to get fixed. I think it's going to continue to put strain on the supply chain. Keep in mind, while we may be sitting here in June right now, going into July, this is going to have impact going into the holiday season, which is when this has the most impact on our overall supply chain in general. So are we in trouble? I don't know. It sure feels like it's a problem that needs to get addressed. I hope it doesn't become a bigger problem, but it's continuing to happen. Meanwhile, I'm hearing about it firsthand level right here in my market where I'm working. So I thought it'd be interesting to share with all of you. If you want to talk about it more, I'd love to hear your thoughts. And as always, thank you for watching.